Hi Aquarius, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing your general love reading. Okay, we're going to be looking into your person to see how they feel about you. Alright, and if you want to book a personal reading with me, just look at my description box down below. Okay, so let's see what's going on. Okay, spirit, how does this person feel about my Aquarius for July 2021? How does this person feel about my Aquarius for July 2021? Okay. So, the first card we have is self-indulgence. Focus on self, self-worth, time to heal, shadow work, and self-appreciation. Okay, so what I'm getting from this card is your person feels like you are in your four swords energy. Okay, so for some of you, you could be dealing with an air sign, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Okay, this person feels like you are in your four swords energy. Okay, um, and you are just focusing on you. You are being independent. You are, you know, not really focusing on anyone else. You're protecting your energy, protecting your vessel. Okay, you guys are in this stage where you guys are healing. Okay, and, you know, this person feels like you are just, you know, spoiling yourself. Okay, you guys are just protecting you. Okay, and just taking care of, taking care of you, right? So, it's like, with this self-indulgence card, it means that your person feels like you are just focusing on yourself. You're not really focusing on anyone else. Okay, you're not even focusing on them. All right? Um, okay, you guys are just, you know, out here doing your thing. Okay? And, <laughs> and yeah, and I feel like because you guys are doing this, your person has a lot of appreciation and has a lot of respect for you. Okay? Um, the next card we have is perception. Outdated thinking. I do see that your person is thinking about you, okay? They're thinking about the events, okay? I feel like your person is thinking about, you know, the times that you've guys shared, maybe. Um, or maybe they just could be thinking about you, period, with this cassette card, okay? And the next card is we have is Healing Heart. Healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationship or addiction. Okay, so I do see that your person is... You know, they're watching, like, they feel like you are just healing, okay, Aquarius? You guys are just, I don't know if it's because maybe there was a recent breakup, okay? There was a breakup between the two of you, okay? This person just sees that you are just healing right now, okay? You, or they want to heal things with you, okay? Because they want to move on from this heartbreak. They want to move on from, you know, all of the, I feel like they've been really in their feelings, or they feel like you are in your feelings, and they want you to heal or they or they see you healing from that. They see you maybe getting better with your emotions. Okay. So let's see. Show me this person for my Aquarius spirit. Show me this person for my Aquarius. Oh wow. Okay. So we have the Two of Cups, the Eight of Wands, and the Page of Wands, okay? I really do hope you guys can hear me. Can you guys hear me? I hope you guys can. Hold on. Because I do not want any of y'all coming at me in the comments about my hearing. Okay. So, your person wants to be with you. With the Two of Cups, the Eight of Wands, and the Page of Wands, some of you guys will be dealing with a fire sign, an Aries or Sagittarius who's really wanting to be with you. Okay, they see you as their their soulmate with the two of cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. Okay, some of you guys present with the water sign. Okay, so it's like this person definitely sees you as, you know, someone who they want to be in a relationship. 
relationship with, someone who they love, someone who they want to connect with, and someone who they want to have a relationship and a commitment with, okay? And that's a beautiful thing, okay? We have the Eight of Wands and the Page of Wands, so both of these cards talks about communication, okay? So, Aquarius, you can't expect some sort of communication from this person, okay? Because I feel like they're ready to talk to you. This person is wanting to come towards you very fast, okay? And they really want to... I feel like this person is ready, okay? Because I feel like there was a lot of, there has to be a lot of healing for this relationship was to be able to move forward, okay? Because we have self-indulgent healing heart. But now it's like this person is ready, okay? They've healed, they've, you know, they've relaxed, okay? And now they're ready to take this forward with you. They're ready to commit. They're ready to start fresh and, you know, have a conversation with you, okay? Um. I feel like maybe you can expect this person to either send you a message through text message, through FaceTime, through email, okay, through some type of DM, whether it's on Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, okay, like this person is wanting to reach out to you, okay, they want to talk, this person is wanting to commit, all right, oh my gosh, I'm sorry, y'all. Um, these cards fell. I can't take these. Spirit, show me this person's feelings towards my Aquarius. Show me this person's feelings towards my Aquarius. Oh, wow. Your energy. We have the star. Okay, so this could be your energy or you guys could be dealing with another Aquarius. Okay, so I do see that your person is wanting to heal. Okay, like again, like I said, something about healing things and, you know, mending things with you. Okay, like this person is ready to remove all the toxicity, remove any type of negative things, any type of negative thoughts. They just want to get rid of it. Like, <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Like, they just don't want to go through it. You know, I feel like it, like it brainwashed them mentally. Like, like I know nobody wants to, nobody ever wants to have those type of energies to have those type of feelings bottled up in them but it's like something about this person is like they're just over Aquarius okay they don't want to fight they don't want to argue they don't want to be mad at you they don't want to get angry with their emotions okay like they just want to be happy they want to be positive okay they don't want to they don't want you guys to be able to hold a grudge against each other okay we have the nine of wands Sagittarius energy so it's like this person does have, they they do maybe feel like you have their, your wall up against them. Okay, you still maybe are blocking your emotions or blocking them from even coming towards you. Okay. Um, but it's like they want to come in. They want to talk to you. Okay. We have the seven of swords and the five of cups. Wow. Okay, so I feel like the, there was a breakup here, okay? And I feel like the reason why there was a lot of healing is because of this breakup, but also because someone here cheated, okay? We have the Seven of Swords. It talks about deception. talks about lies. talks about third party. talks about cheating. So this person definitely could have put you through all of that, um, Aquarius, okay? And with the Five of Cups, they have a lot of regret about that. Okay, they regret even putting you through this. They regret even treating you this way. And that's why they want to come in. They want to heal things. And they want to mend things with you. Okay. They don't want you guys to break up. We have the Emperor, Aries energy. Yeah. So it's like they want to come in. They want to be in control. Like this person is really ready to step up. And, you know, get to you. And really step up. And, you know, probably even come out and tell you the truth. Spirit. How does this person feel about my sag? I mean, not my sag, my Aquarius. How does this person feel about my Aquarius? I hope you guys can hear me. Oh my gosh. Yeah, look, we have the lovers. Okay, some of you guys can be dealing with a Gemini. And we also have the Six of Cups. Okay. So yes, I do believe that this is someone from your past, okay, who wants to come towards you and have a reconciliation, okay. Um, now this could have been a, like a childhood friend, someone who you've known for a long time, 
okay, who is really wanting to come to court, ends with you. Okay, they're thinking about you, they're missing you, okay, and they look at you as their soulmate. We have the lovers and the two of cups, okay? This is someone who really wants to be committed to you, okay, Aquarius? This person really has a lot of your love and a lot of emotions and feelings for you, okay? And they regret their wrongs. They regret doing whatever they did to you, okay? Because now they see that it was wrong, you know? And, you know, it's, it's just better than, it's just better to heal things than, you know, keep being this type of person for the rest of their life you know like they want to change like they want to become a better person for you they're not going to do that they're not going to do whatever they did okay they're not going to cheat they're going to be you know this person is wanting to be a better person for you okay so yeah that's going to be it for today's reading you guys if it resonated with you feel free to like this video comment down below your thoughts and opinions on this Okay, I really do appreciate every single last one of you uh, and love you guys, okay, because, you know, I love all of my supporters. Um, and yeah, if you want to book a personal reading with your girl, you can look at my description box down below. Okay, I love you guys so much and talk to you soon. Bye.